What's going on guys? Welcome to Esco Films. So today I'm gonna be making a video while driving, so hopefully I don't crash or anything. Um, I know the lighting's kind of bad, but I mean, we're gonna have to deal with it, man. But uh, basically today I'm just gonna be talking about panic attacks, you know? See, that's, oh shit, my camera's about to fall. All right. Basically, I'm just gonna be talking about panic attacks. Um, you know, I've had my fair share of panic attacks, I guess, uh, last year's when I got my first panic attack ever. So we're gonna talk about that. So basically, I remember I was going to work, I was driving to work, listening to music, having a good day, having a good time, you know? And uh, out of nowhere, I just started to feel like scared and like just weird. My throat started feeling weird. My heart started racing, I started sweating. You know, I just felt scared, you know? Uh, I got to work, I got my check, and then I was driving back home. And on the drive back home, <clears throat> on the drive back home, basically, um, I, I was like super scared. Like I was in panic attack mode, you know? Like I was literally having a panic attack. But I didn't know what it was at the time, because you know, I never had a panic attack in my life. So I was like, you know, I'm in my dying or some shit, you know? So basically what happened was, after I got the check, I ended up going to my house, but I still felt super bad, so I ended up going to the urgent care. But while while I was at the urgent care, I just, I didn't, you know, they were taking too damn long. So we called the ambulance, and then the ambulance came, and they basically said, like, well, we can't really do anything, because it's not like I'm having an emergency, you know? But at the time, I felt like, I'm about to die, bro, like. But, you know, obviously it wasn't an emergency, it was just a panic attack. Um, so basically after that I went home again and then again I started feeling like again like super bad. I basically just ended up going to the hospital, like the actual community hospital. And I was there. They gave me an Ativan, it's just a little pill, made me calm down, I felt way better. I ended up going home. The next day I remember I was going to I was gonna go do something and I was on the freeway, I was driving and I started feeling like I was gonna have a panic attack again. So I drove all the way back to the hospital, um, the one that I was at the night before. But I didn't, I didn't go in, I didn't check myself in. I just basically was in the parking lot, like sitting down there, because I just felt like, I just felt safe, you know? I felt way safer just sitting there than like driving around or going home or something. So after that, um, I basically, I was doing better, you know, after that, I, I didn't really have panic attacks. Uh, I was just having like anxiety, you know, bad anxiety, but I was doing better. And around December, I remember it was around December of like last year, um, around like Christmas time, I was gonna go deliver a hoodie for my clothing brand, Lone World Clothing. Um, and I uh, I was basically like at the red light, just like sitting there, you know, waiting for the light to turn green. And out of nowhere, I just thought like, damn, like what if I have a panic attack right now? Like who's gonna help me? No one's there to help me, you know? So I just got scared and uh, I drove home. I had like a mini panic attack. It wasn't crazy or anything, but after that, I kind of got scared to like be alone. Cause I was like, damn, like what if I have a panic attack? Who's here to help me, you know? No one's here to help me, but um, I mean now I'm doing better with that. But this whole year it was it was like that, you know. I was like, damn, like I can't go anywhere, I can't do anything. It basically took over my life, you know. It really did for a while, you know. Now I'm doing way better. I'm doing way better now. Um, but this whole year was kind of bad, you know. March of this year was like the worst year of my life, honestly. The worst month. I'm sorry. It was like the worst month of, of this year and of my life, to be honest. Cause that's when I was having like super bad anxiety, man. Like I was literally having like suicidal thoughts. Like I wasn't gonna kill myself cause I ain't, I ain't brave enough to do that. But I was like, I was like super depressed, man. I was like super depressed, super just sad. Like I was like, man, like this sucks, bro. And it wasn't cause of anxiety or panic attacks. It was cause of something else that I'll talk about in another video if you guys want me to. But I'll talk about that in another video. Um, it was basically cause of that. And because of anxiety, you know, anxiety is what caused that, you know, so it was kind of anxiety, but um, I was at the hospital that day, all day, you know, I was like in the mental, the mental health area. Um, there was like crazy people in there, man, there was people with like schizo schizophrenia, like it was crazy, like, like I never want to go back there again, it was, it was really crazy. I remember a girl ran out of there trying to like escape. I was like, what the hell, man? Like, they, they gave me an Adam on there too. I felt better, but I still didn't feel like like myself, I guess. 
I went home, I ended up going home. And after that, I really got motivated, you know, because I remember I called my cousin when I, when I was in the hospital. And um, he really he really told me, like, you need to work out, you need to start eating healthy, you know, you need to start doing stuff. You can't just think about anxiety, you know, because that's literally what I would think about every single day, all day, is anxiety, 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 panic attack, you know? It sucked, it was so stupid, man, and I hated it. You know, anybody who deals with panic attacks, you know what I'm talking about, man, because it sucks. I was super motivated to get better. I started eating healthy, I started working out, I started praying, I started going to church, I started doing everything. Like, I started to change my whole life, you know? I myself down, you know, it's super important to take care of your mental health. It's, it, like, it really is, man. If you're out there and dealing with anxiety or panic attacks, man, just try to better yourself, you know? Try to take care of yourself. Um, eat healthy, you know, work out. Um, read the Bible, go to church, you know, go out, want to walk, do something productive, you know, don't be at home all day just thinking about it. But yeah, after that, I was, I did have panic attacks, obviously, but that's when I started seeing a psychologist, a psychiatrist, you know, I started getting help, like, because I didn't want this to ruin my life, man, like, like, I really didn't, you know, so I fought, I fought it, like, I really did, I was like, fuck this, man, like, like, this isn't gonna, this is not gonna take over my life. And I know it did take over my life for a minute, but I got through it. You know, I still go through it every day. You know, I literally had one yesterday. I still go through it. You know, I still take medicine. I still go to see my psychologist. But, you know, every day I'm getting better with it. Every day I'm understanding what panic attacks and anxiety is. Um, that's why I want to go to college, man. I want to be a psychologist one day. But some tips and tricks that I would give you for panic attacks is um, try, try deep breathing, you know. It's called like the four by four. It's something my therapist. Breathe in for four seconds, hold it for four seconds, and then let it out for four seconds. And you, you do that four times. And honestly, it does help. Cause I remember I was like, I'm not gonna do no deep breathing. Like what the hell is that gonna do, you know? But I'm telling you, it really does help. You have to just practice every single day. Like literally do it for like a minute and you'll, you'll get good at it. Cause you don't want to do it when you're like having a panic attack cause it's not gonna work. And I've been through that, I'm telling you, it's not gonna work. If you need any any help, you know, just hit me up. I'll try to help you out or something. Please follow me on Instagram, at Esco Films, E-S-G-O Films, and also on Twitter. Please subscribe, like, leave a comment. I'm about to go now, because I need to drive, so. I'll see you guys later, peace.